Welcome to AutoSpec. Today, we're diving into the fierce and iconic Fairchild Republic A10 Thunderbolt II, affectionately known as the Warthog. Designed for close air support, the A10 has earned a legendary reputation due to its durability, firepower, and effectiveness on the battlefield. Let's get into the details of this remarkable jet, exploring its design, fuel economy, operational history, and the trophies it has earned in combat. Design and Structure The A-10 Thunderbolt II was designed by Fairchild Republic, initially entering service in 1976. Built to endure harsh conditions, its rugged design focuses on survivability and close-range attacks on ground targets. The A-10's armor is exceptionally resilient, with titanium armor plating around the cockpit and critical systems, allowing it to absorb direct hits from projectiles up to 23 mm. Its low wing loading and high lift wing design enable superior maneuverability at low speeds and altitudes, ideal for providing ground support. The aircraft is instantly recognizable by its distinctive twin engine configuration mounted high on the fuselage, which protects them from debris and damage during low altitude operations. The A-10's landing gear is designed to function even if the wheels don't fully extend, enhancing its survivability in emergency scenarios. Power and Performance Powered by two General Electric TF34GE100 turbofan engines, the A-10 has a top speed of around 420 miles per hour, 676 kilometers per hour, and a range of approximately 800 miles without refueling. Its operational ceiling reaches about 45,000 feet, though it typically operates much lower. The aircraft's engines are mounted away from the fuselage, increasing safety by minimizing the risk of debris damage, and they are relatively fuel efficient, though the overall cost can still be significant during prolonged operations. Fuel Efficiency and Costs The A-10's engines prioritize durability and reliability over speed, making them more fuel efficient for ground support roles. However, each hour of flight can consume about 1,200 gallons of fuel, depending on the mission requirements. The operational costs for an hour in flight can be around $20,000, covering maintenance, fuel, and other logistical expenses, which is relatively cost-effective compared to newer jets with more complex systems. Armament and Firepower the A-10's primary weapon, the GAU-8-A Avenger Rotary Cannon, is one of the most powerful aircraft cannons in the world. This 30mm Gatling-style gun can fire approximately 3,900 rounds per minute, devastating armored vehicles, bunkers, and even fortified buildings. Complementing the GAU-8 are a variety of hardpoints on the wings and fuselage, allowing the A-10 to carry an impressive payload of AGM-65 Maverick missiles, Hydra rockets, MK-82 bombs, and other ordnance, providing flexibility to engage a range of targets. Operational History and War Trophies Throughout its service life, the A-10 has proven itself in several major conflicts, notably the Gulf War, the Kosovo Conflict, and more recently, operations in Afghanistan and Iraq. During Operation Desert Storm, the A-10 played a significant role, with pilots flying thousands of sorties and reportedly destroying over 900 Iraqi tanks, 2,000 military vehicles, and numerous artillery pieces. The jet earned numerous war trophies on these missions, taking out key targets and establishing its reputation as a tank buster. The aircraft's durability has been highlighted in various missions where it tends return to base with significant damage, including lost hydraulic systems, shrapnel impacts, and other severe damage. Its survivability and ability to continue operations even with substantial battle damage have solidified the A-10's place as a critical asset in the U.S. Air Force. Modern Upgrades and Future Over time, the A-10 has received multiple upgrades to extend its service life, such as the Precision Engagement Upgrade, which added advanced targeting and night vision capabilities, allowing the A-10 to operate effectively in various combat scenarios. Modernization efforts have focused on enhancing avionics, cockpit controls, and weapon systems to ensure that the A-10 remains effective despite its age. With its scheduled retirement repeatedly delayed, the A-10's future has been a topic of ongoing discussion. 
The aircraft's low operational costs, effectiveness, and suitability for close air support make it a valuable asset that may continue in service until the 2030s, despite plans to replace it with more modern, multi-role jets like the F-35. Conclusion the Fairchild Republic A-10 Thunderbolt II stands as an unparalleled icon in military aviation. Its resilience, immense firepower, and record of successful missions have made it a symbol of close air support. While newer aircraft may be faster or more technologically advanced, few can rival the A-10's combat effectiveness and durability. Thank you for joining us at Autospec. If you enjoyed this in-depth look at the A-10 Thunderbolt 2, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more fascinating reviews of legendary aircraft.